Hello friends, I am Greetings for the day. Welcome back to another tutorial on technical vocabulary where we learn meaning and definition of several technical words. As a part of today's tutorial, we are talking about test summary report. A test summary report basically describes or gives a nutshell information about all the activities which has been performed as a part of the entire software testing lifecycle for a particular project and generally it is prepared by the test manager. Now, when it comes to the test summary report, it basically consists of a brief information about every single thing which can talk about what exactly we have performed as a part of testing. So be it about the test planning, be it talking about the creation of the test scenarios, determining that why you went with the logical test cases or where you went for the concrete test cases, what kind of test techniques you have utilized, how these techniques were helpful to identify the defects and how what kind of coverage you have achieved by these executions. Also, when it comes to the RTM, will be a part of it showcasing that what kind of requirement coverage you have achieved by writing n number of test cases. Also, we talk about the test execution report can be a part of the test summary report and in summarized way that to totally execute these many number of test cases and out of which these may have passed and so many failed, which resulted into identification of different critical defects and we have resolved them all. As a part of test summary report, you will also like to include that what are the defects which are residual could not be resolved and there are risk items which you identified initially have they be resolved or they are still uh, like residual or have been mitigated or not. So this summary report will actually be a deliverable to the customer as well and will be narrating them that throughout the testing lifecycle, what kind of effort you have taken, what kind of activities you have performed and whether this activities has resulted into a quality product at the end of the day or not. The executions will not be just limited to functional testing. It will also talk about all the non-functional levels being conducted in order to improvise the quality characteristics of an application. And put together, we'll get a complete understanding of all the testing which is being conducted, which has resulted into adding more value to the quality of the product at the end of the day. So we were just talking about the test summary report and i hope you got a very good clarity about the same in case you have any other words with you which you want me to talk about feel free to drop them below and i'm here to assist you and talk about them till then keep learning keep exploring keep understanding the context thanks for watching the video team and happy learning